The computer mouse was invented in the early 1960s. In the 70s, it was popularized by Xerox. In the 80s, the computer mouse made its way into products like Apple Macintosh and Microsoft Windows. Nowadays, we are all familiar how it looks and works, but there are some alternatives. In my left hand, I have an old Nintendo Nunchuck controller made for playing games on Nintendo Wii. And in my right hand, I have a computer mouse. These two devices have completely different shapes, but actually they can be used for the same purpose. In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate you how to turn Nintendo Wii Nunchuck controller into a USB device and use it as a mouse. This little board is called Anavi Hando and it is an open source hardware USB to Nunchuck adapter. It converts Wii Nunchuck controller into a USB device. Step number one is to connect your Nunchuck controller to the computer using Anavi Hando and an appropriate USB-C cable. If everything is ok, there will be a green light on the LED to indicate that the connection is successful. The computer will recognize Anavi Hando as a USB storage device. Open file config.json and make sure that type is set to mouse. Step number 3. Just enjoy and use your nunchuck as a computer mouse. Move the cursor with the joystick on the nunchuck. Some gamers complain that nunchuck has only two buttons, but actually this is pretty convenient if you want to use it as a mouse because you have a left and a right mouse button. It is worth noting that the nunchuck controller also has a 3-axis accelerometer. As of the moment, the open source firmware of Anavi Hando doesn't take advantage of this hardware feature. We can update the open source firmware and support it, maybe for uh, adding a scroll or something else. I don't know, if you have any ideas, please leave a comment below. Honestly, using a nunchuck as a mouse is weird, it's strange, but it's a lot of fun. It's definitely worth trying it at least once in your lifetime. It could be handy for playing games and specific use cases though. So how does it work? Nunchuck has a very specific proprietary connector by Nintendo, but actually it works over the popular I2C bus. Anavi Hando has been designed with the free and open source software KiCad. It is powered by Xiao module with the mighty Raspberry Pi RP2040 microcontroller. There is also a USB-C connector. The firmware makes it work as a human interface device, which means it's compatible with Microsoft Windows, Mac OS or Linux distributions, like in this video I'm using it on Ubuntu. Anavi Hando comes pre-installed with CircuitPython and open source firmware that I have created. The source code of the firmware is available at GitHub. It's based on several Adafruit libraries for Nunchuck. The firmware supports three modes. You can use it as a gamepad or a joystick. You can use it as a keyboard. And the third mode is to use it as a mouse. I have already covered the two other modes in previous videos. And in this short video, I'm demonstrating using the Nunchuck as a mouse. You can change the supported modes in the configuration file config.json. Nunchuck is a really cool and interesting controller. And if you have one, you can convert it in a USB device with Anavi Hando. In this short video, I demonstrated how to use Nunchuck as a computer mouse to move the cursor with the joystick and to use the two buttons. I have to admit that this is a very strange computer mouse, but it's really fun to try. I don't expect anyone to use Nunchuck on a daily basis as a computer mouse, but it can be useful for specific practical use cases. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please hit the like button, subscribe to my YouTube channel and stay tuned for new videos.